Uh, hey, I don't really know, brother. I never did pay it. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a Muslim, but, you know. <laughs> well, what about Hajj? Did you make your Hajj yet? Hajj? Uh, no, uh, brother. Uh, you know, it costs a lot of money to go for Hajj. And, uh, Allah didn't want to make anything hard for me, you know. So, uh, you know. Well, last year, you took off a whole month and flew to the United States, took your kids and your family to Disney World in Florida. What was you doing, making tell-off around Epcot Center? <laughs> well, I'm a Muslim, but, uh, you know, that's a lot of... You know, I might not get a visa, something like that, you know. Well, let me ask you another question, brother. Isn't it in Islam that you're supposed to let your beard grow? Isn't that what, there's a hadith, somebody told me it's a hadith. You have to let your beard grow. You're not supposed to cut it off. Isn't that what it says, Sahih Bukhari? Well, brother, you know how it is. They might fire me or something. They're liable to, you know, I'm Muslim, but he can't expect me to, you know. And what about, does that mean your wife is a Muslim too? Yeah. She don't wear a hijab? Yeah, brother, but, you know, that's back then. And today, you know, it's, uh, yeah, you know, we're Muslim, but... I got it. You're a Muslim, but... That's a start. Just need some legs, a body, some arms, a head, and you can be a whole Muslim. MashaAllah! Instead of just a Muslim butt. And basically that's the way a lot of us today are treating our deen. I hope, and I pray to Allah, that the words that were said here tonight will have a real impact on us so that we can have a more positive tomorrow. Because that's the reason I came all the way here to New Zealand. Because that purpose of life is something that came to me very late in my life, but alhamdulillah Allah gave it to me. I'm real thankful to Allah for the Muslim who took the time for three months to help me to better understand this complete way of fulfilling my purpose and duty to my Lord. I'm very thankful to Allah and I'm very thankful to that person for being patient with me. I'm hoping that some here, all of them here, will pick up this same concept and go out and share this message with these people here because I didn't find anybody on this planet that are any more deserving to know the truth about real Islam than these wonderful people right here in New Zealand. Am I right? But whose job is it to teach them? You're right here with me. Share that purpose. تستورنا القرآن وديننا الإسلام أركانه الجليلة دعائم الفديلة ويا الشهرتان كعيدة الإيمان والصوم والصلاة وحج والسلام